we have a new vehicle on the road which is accessible so there is a wheelchair lift and there's spots for two wheelchairs as well as 12 other riders and the the idea of the bus is um, to get people um, from Huntsville um, to Aurelia and we stop at all of the stops um, in between so um, Port Sydney, Bracebridge, Gravenhurst, Kilworthy, Washago. So you can use the bus, you know, if you need to get to work in a different town. It can be kind of a commuter bus or for students. We stop at Georgian College in Bracebridge and Aurelia. Um, we also stop at the Aurelia Hospital. So it's really, you know, for whatever trip purpose you need. Um, that's kind of the idea. And the new schedule, we also announced a new schedule. Um, that schedule will be in effect on Monday, November 23rd. So we remove the Aurelia to Barry portion of the route because the Simcoe County Lynx actually runs very frequently between Aurelia and Barry. So we have ensured that we have a common bus stop at the Aurelia Georgian College campus so people can easily transfer onto the Simcoe Link service. And then what we were able to do, um, since we kind of saved those service hours, we were able to reinvest those into um, more service within the district. So now we have just three daily round trips between Huntsville and Aurelia. So the schedule is now the same on every day of the week. Previous, this current schedule is different on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays than it is on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So now we just will have the same schedule on every day of the week, which will make it easier for people. And we've also added some stops in Huntsville and Gravenhurst um, to help uh, people access the bus. The fees, the schedule, everything can be found on our website, on the uh, district website on the Corridor 11 bus page. We also post regularly updates on Facebook and we also have an Engage Muskoka website page that also has some information. But the District of Muskoka Corridor 11 page would have all of the most up-to-date information.